I'll do it. Matt, do you remember? We're right in a cutscene. I totally remember that. Let's go get some Ringu. <laughs> you gotta help me out. Give me Virtua Cop's voice. Virtua Cop. That's I his name. Know. The guy who looks like Simmons. Oh god, yeah, he does look like Simmons. <laughs> okay, so we just got the machine gun, we just got the grenade launcher, now we gotta remember how to fight. Okay, that's how I use the gun button. What the fighting oh, in Jesus. Ringu. Where's my light? Oh There's my, my light. God. Yeah, you need that. Okay, okay, don't there, worry, don't worry, don't worry. There he goes. I got him now. Oh, there we go. Don't miss, though. I don't know why I missed those shots. Oh my god, he takes so much. Bam, easy. That's Is too that... much. It's too much damage. And that's it, apparently. <laughs> I think this was the enemy Heck, for... It's over. I think we got the grenade launcher just for this fight, and I guess no need. Yes, so. You saved us. Looks like it's over. <laughs> yes, we... Yes, this has been established. You <laughs> gotta be kidding. What were you doing? Don't get so mad. I was battling it out with the guys inside. Outside. I, I guess outside. there was other enemies. The guys outside? Yeah, the guys oh, inside. Well. This is okay, right? Yeah, you saved us. It makes him crazy, buddy. <laughs> Why is he morphing into the crazy taxi announcer? <laughs> if you're done, help the guys on the upper floors. We've only ever met, like, one other person in VR Troopers here. I guess we're going to meet more. Upper floors? There's something up there? Yeah, there's upper floors. Yeah, there seems to be quite a number of enemies, and they're having trouble. The enemies are having trouble? Take a breather and go help them. You really know how to use people. What? All right. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I got to ask. We're counting on you. Koopo. Okay, I guess that's that. That's uh, so weird. So this room seems to be pretty empty otherwise. But there is a... Fuck. Oh, wait, what is it's that? What is that? I hope it's another fun poster. It's uh no, it's a statue. It's statue, 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 statue. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Those I hope posters later were great though. There's a though. poster that says statue. That would be suitable at this point, wouldn't it? And it's really fucked up for me to have seen something or seen some dialogue in this game, and for me to remark that's weird. <laughs> Most uh, okay. everything else. So, All right, so I guess you're looking for another ladder or staircase. Yeah, but first I gotta reload my gun. Okay, so I still have quite a bit. I have a lot of handgun bullets as well, and the grenade launcher, which we still actually haven't used. Only one healing item. I guess. I'll well, we used it in an item capacity. That counts. Which was so weird. Oh jeez. Oh, just forget it. Yeah, Do we I'm need to punish lost. every single enemy we come across? Yeah. <laughs> Meg, the punisher. Okay, that wasn't so bad. So we need to go upstairs now. <laughs> You'll have to forgive oh, me, Jesus. but oh jeez, it's back. Oh, 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 the deeks! Oh. The I juke. can't believe that worked. We good? I think you're good. I heard a crunchy nice. sound we of got death. Him. Okay, so let's find the upstairs. I assume that involves going up the ladder. Uh, up the ladder or up the the not spiral staircase, but the. God, I, I mean, you know what? The map does tell you, we, right? We do have a map, so... Okay, we're in this dead end. Uh, oh, you know what? We had just come to this north area here, and all these rooms are actually new, so I should probably take a moment to scope them all out. Uh, great, Maybe. Okay. I mean, if he's telling you you have to go upstairs, then there might be not... I mean, you can get some items, maybe, but... You know. Yeah, I mean, the items themselves will be worth it, so let's go into isolation first. That's that's a that's a dank room, the isolation room. Oh man, this is like very Resident Evil lab. Very microwave hallway. Oh my god! <laughs> the shit! Where did I, he come from? Yeah, he must have fallen from the ceiling or something. That was kind of nonsense. Okay, I got you. Okay. How do I how do I just reload again? I don't think there was a just reload button, was there? Uh. It's okay. 
I'm already. I guess no. I there. think there was. We started reloading manually a lot because there's never time to reload <laughs> when the when the alien mutants are hitting you with fundamental combos yeah. with their bread and butters. But here's the thing. You're you know you're using ammo and stuff here. This is this is a survival horror game here, Liam. Yeah. So will oh. this be worth it? I mean, we're just gonna have to hope it is, right? And you put the shotgun away in storage, did yeah. you not? Yeah, I did. Yeah, we're gonna have to get back to that one. But it might, I mean, it might be worth it. We'll find out. If we find any assault rifle ammo, it's worth it by default, because that's, that gun's guess so, so good. Uh, do you, you have a bag? Oh, jeez! <laughs> Toilet monster! Classic scare. And that guy went down quick. Yeah, he's like, he's like, if I wait in the toilet long enough, someone will surely open up a door. It's like snickering to himself. <laughs> I'll get her For next. Hours. Get her on the crapper. Okay, is there gonna be another fucking toilet monster? Oh man. There might be, but there's definitely a toilet corner monster. Good aim, loser. Hunter Gamma is down. Oh my god. Oh! Wow, I should have done a save before coming in here. I've taken many hits. I should actually check my life shortly. It was normal before. Ooh, what's that? I think these are batteries. batteries multiple of them. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I, so, I think I have to heal something. anyway. Oh no, I'm only Still at normal. normal. Okay. Well, you know what? If I reload the handgun, we have a slot. There we go. Okay. Easy as that. You do need that, like... Yeah, there's two of them, it's so it's a, handy. It's a weird thing when half the game is... Oh, shit. Half oh, the game is, is cool. fighting, and then the other half isn't. So it's like, how do you adequately prepare weapons and items? I mean, that's... Because like you, you never know when you're actually going to need them or not. The, the Resident Evil dilemma, right? Okay, which, yeah, which but, item was more effective... Uh, that one's medium. Okay, and the other one must be high. Yeah, okay. So I'll Large, use the medium one. largely high. Great, but fine. what I mean is that like there's going to be like an hour or two of not having to do this stuff, so you kind of tend to forget about it. Oh, after you a mean while. back in the real world? Yeah. Yeah, the real world. Oh, you could also do that in lieu of that would have been helpful. On your flashlight. <laughs> it's okay. My flashlight's full, and I got an extra battery, so can't complain. Uh, please. I gotta stop playing and fast forward. <laughs> please. Oh! Oh! And you gotta start Don't worry, I got to the, the door. I got to the door. Oh, wow. <laughs> you did it. We're good. The door can't in animation. Oh! <laughs> Just run away. Da, da. I, I'll, you know what? I'll do it. Oh, fuck. Isolation 2! Yeah. What's, what was up with that melee strike? Have you been not been doing that? No, that was just to shake off, I think. Oh, that was just, it looks like she was throwing bows. Okay, this is as good a spot as any to do a to do a safety save. Safety save. Is that yeah, so okay, there we go. You're another demon monster. Um so I think I have to change gun, because I think I only have like one handgun bullet left i have two You're so two. i guess i'm gonna have to use the assault rifle unfortunately uh got no other i, I, I don't know man i think it. if you have to help fight monsters in the upper floors maybe you should cut your losses here and head up there's so many rooms we're missing out on then i like, know but you're probably gonna come back here you know i don't know i i just don't want you to be in a situation where you have to go upstairs and you have no ammo i think i'll be okay I have faith uh, in myself. You've been playing this game your entire life, so I guess you know. I'm very practiced. <laughs> it sucks you can't shoot in first person. Yeah, that would be really helpful. <laughs> Just kind of bumble your way over to him. I'm near that guy the bed, pretty... he'll never get me. Yeah, he keeps getting caught. And monsters get caught in the bed sometimes. It's hard. Yeah, I don't know that that hit. No idea. Oh! <laughs> Great! Was that? Perfect! It works perfectly. <laughs> Is there even anything in here? There's the drawer, so let's hope the drawer has something good. Unfortunately, I'm out of inventory slots, 
Okay, yeah. Okay, well, goals. that's good. My inventory is full. Uh, okay, does that mean my hand... Oh, no, my... Okay. Uh, you know, let's just uh, get rid of this other battery, then. Damn it. It's, it's worth it. So I came... You need the battery. So I came in here and spent... Assault rifle bullets. A bunch of them. And right. used a battery and got handgun bullets. That that doesn't seem like this room was worth it. <laughs> I guess not. Uh, nonetheless, let's uh, re-equip that. So I don't have to... Oh, that's a lot of handgun bullets, though, actually. That was 30 handgun bullets. So maybe that will you actually... shot a lot of bullets. Maybe it will prove to be worth it. Oh! Don't worry, we're good, we're good, we're good. Uh, that guy's got nothing. Oh, the bathroom's yeah. already open in this one, thank god. So you don't get a bathroom scare. Yeah. The scariest of them all. Those have been rough, light, I, I gotta admit. Because the monsters know you're weak in close quarters combat. Mm -hmm. and, and, and by weak I say, you don't know it. Oh no, shit. You don't know how to perform the close quarters. Uh, what is that? I think there's an enemy maybe in the uh, the little yeah, entrance maybe. to this area. Oh! <laughs> Let's just That's not... a frost... You, you see, it's a frost giant! I'm, I refuse to interact with the frost giant. <laughs> okay, so... This way was new rooms as well. That one's no locked. It's the that... most locked a door could be. That's level, level four. four. We're only in levels one to three. And there's this door. Okay, cool. No That's good. everything then. The monsters are like, you know, all these doors are locked. You're not oh. going to have much choice here. Wait, what is that door? Hang on, let me, <laughs> let me check the map. It's a mysterious door. No, you better check it. Oh, no, that is where I came from. Okay, that was... Okay. Wait. Yeah, yeah, that was the single room we went in to do combat. So, okay, I gotta yeah. go all the way to the end of this hallway, and then uh, that I guess was epic sounding. I don't it know. Is if... the single room we entered and initiated combat? Yes, that's it. Yes. I assume combat in quotation marks. I thought this room was called Chad. Oh fuck! This is the wrong room. Yeah, this is actually where you fought the guy. I wish I could read the map and actually pay attention to it at the same time. Um, eh. Yeah, it's overrated. No one's been ever be able to do it in the past, so you don't, you know, don't uh, put that expectation on yourself. It's simply unfair. Okay. <laughs> it's just not fair to you. So the question is now whether we take the staircase up. Oh. Or. Oh God. Yeah, I'm sorry. Do not waste bullets on that guy. <laughs> Even though I got all these handgun bullets. Oh, there's if an enemy in here. He, if he doesn't give you the timer code. Nice, nice, good combo, good combo. Oh, okay. Can he keep? Can he keep it up though? Yes, he, yes, he fucking can. Oh man, tragedy. Oh, I got some good hits in though. Lost a lot of bullets for nothing. It's empty inside. It's we're all empty inside. Okay, I'm still fine though, actually. So. Yeah. Relatively fine for Grudju. As fine as it gets, honestly. For Juanju. Oh shit! Okay, this should be the staircase, not that room. Yeah, there we go. So, lots of people in the comments have been saying how it seems that this game really pulls from the novels instead of the movies. Really? Okay, yeah. that's interesting. All, all these concepts that we're reading about in the notes. It's all it's all from the novels, like and the follow up ones. That's actually really neat. Um, I mean, that's pretty neat, pretty stupid, <laughs> in the sense of like putting this game out for for Westerners who wouldn't actually know the yeah. novels at all. I mean, what are you because gonna do, it, right? It, it follows stuff up on them, so you really need to to have has some type of familiarity with them to get the most out of the narrative. So this is authentic, then? This is... It is authentic. Legitimate. You know, okay, I think you know, we're coming out. Like, what a weird thing. Like, there we the go. Movie... Hey, virtual oh, pup. shit. I'm here because he told me to help the guys on this floor. But what do I need to do? I'm sorry. I'm not sure myself. 
Man! Oh my god, it's him! It's Jack! <laughs> huh? Jack! Jack, how did you get here? This is inside that game, right? Probably. To tell you the truth, I just started the game. I ended up here. Can it be? This game is networked? <laughs> In any case, it's a little strange. I sometimes can't tell which is reality. Oh shit. Yeah, I surprised myself. Let's uh, start up a LAN party, play some Halo. Doesn't feel like I'm controlling anything. <laughs> Meg! Look out! <laughs> There's one of the monkeys from the books. You! You monk damn dirty what? apes! I can't. This isn't true. Meg! Jack! Shit. Meg! Meg! What? What were you trying to infer there? Yeah, I'm, not, I'm not clear what's happening to Meg here. But doesn't we're out. Quite have, doesn't quite have the cutscene direction that Clock Tower 3 had. No. <laughs> Are you awake? Chief! Dr. Jones! What did I... When I had our security guard, Lucino, I heard you ran away from him. No, he suddenly told me he was going to hold me down, and so... Hold? I guess you could put it that way. All the lab members are waiting in their rooms now. Right now, everyone in this facility is being tested for a particular virus. Testing for a virus? Yeah, we confirmed a virus that we think was the one that killed Bobbert. You confirmed a virus? Yes, with a fucking CDC corporation. <laughs> yes, we are having all the lab members undergo big blood tests. Especially you. Lots of blood from you. We wanted to hurry up with your tests. But he didn't want to alarm the entire facility. So the chief was kind enough to send Lucino over to your room to steal your blood? That seemed oh, to cause a misunderstanding. Just a misunderstanding. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, but if you figured out God. which virus, can't you respond to it without causing much panic and confusion? We were able to determine which virus, but we still don't know the infection method. There is no infection method. There is no infection method. Perhaps there is no such thing as a virus. For, for this part. There is no infection method? A joke, of course. It has to have some method of infection. We can't find it for this virus. Enough about this virus! It's like the most important thing happening. There is no <laughs> method of infection? Is it a curse? Hey! Sorry, I've been computer programs and curses! <laughs> You call yourself a research assistant, Chief! Yeah, I know. This text is In going case, so quick now. We're done getting your blood sample. If you want, if you can walk, go back to your room and wait for the test results. Yes, but that virus. <laughs> Meg, stay in your room. Yes. Oh my God! That, that what a bunch of nonsense. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. I mean, that's kind of the whole game, though, right? Yeah, yeah. It's very on brand. Excuse, Excuse me. me. What do you want? Are you here to hold me down again? <laughs> Don't be so alarmed. I'm sorry about earlier. I realized I phrased it badly. Nice. It's all right now. You don't seem to be a bad guy either. So you came all the way here to apologize? I'm bad guy. No, that's not quite it. I actually have something I wanted to talk to you about. Something? What is it? I'm talking to you about this because you're Robert's girlfriend. Man, is, he, is he gonna end up being our co-conspirator and figuring this out? That would be a nice twist. I want to talk to you about none other than the CDC. <laughs> It's weird for me to talk to you about this, but I heard a lot about you from Robert. You were friends with Robert? Then, then, you could have said so much earlier. I mean, you told the chief about the reference room? Tell the chief? You've got to be kidding. 
that place is always watched over by the chief. I warned you because I'm sure you went in, not knowing that. Huh? But I can't say as much there. That's why it ended up that way. Always watching over. It's tapped? He's doing such a thing? He is the chief, probably. <laughs> anyway, Robert started to investigate the underground. And he made it to the reference room, then the basement. I got worried because you were doing the same thing, so I came here. I see. Robert did see it then. Yeah. And he started frequenting the basement of this place, getting high as fuck. He started saying that there's something about this lab. He also said that there were patients underground. And that there was a room beyond them. But he never made it to that <laughs> backwards beyond room. Oh, that must be the level four room. Because we don't I guess. have a level four key card. We're going to have to kill the chief to get it, I think. Or Lucino. Eat one of them. And we try to find a way to go to the back room. Yeah, that's right. There has to be something back there. Only if there was... Yeah, only if there was a way to go back there. Only if. Man, who translated this? Why would you not write if only? <laughs> yeah. There is. There is a way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's what we talked about when I last saw Robert. If we drop the electric, if we drop the electricity of the entire lab, we can disable all security items. Therefore, you can go back there. That's a rather harsh method. <laughs> but are you sure about that? Yeah, I'm sure. I am security chief after all. I checked the manual to make <laughs> <laughs> the instruction booklet for the facility. <laughs> One condition. Three minutes. Oh, God, another timer. Power goes out. Some of the lights security system come back up. In three minutes? Got you three minutes of playtime. It's no good unless you can get back there within three minutes of dropping all power. That's right. But if it's still going to go, I'll drop the power. But there's only one chance. If we fail and the chief finds us out, I'm sure we... Like, what? He's going to kill you? Yeah. <laughs> of course I'm going to go. It's okay. I can drop the power as well. Drop the power? Don't be stupid. You can't even get yourself safely out of this room. And if someone was around, he would raise suspicion. Don't worry about the power. This is a very weird conversation. <laughs> but then I would cause you. Don't give me that. Robert, Robert died. Do you think I'm not regretting his death? I appreciate that Lucino is becoming our ally here. I do as well. I'm regretting it too. I want to go through what he was investigating until the end. If I was smarter, <laughs> I would have done it myself. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about your stupidity. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> but if the chief raises his suspicions, you'd be in trouble too. Oh my god, we're just talking in circles. I'll yeah. get the power. <laughs> <laughs> Enough already! I will drop the power. This is my condition for going through with this plan. In any case, you can't leave this room. I'll drop the power tonight. What time? If the power drops, the building will be pitch black. Here's a battery. Oh, thank you. Don't be so one-sided. No questions asked. That's not what you... So are you going to do it or not? All right. That's fine. All right. Until then, sit tight in this room. We'll start tonight in three hours. It looks like you have a flashlight. You'll be able to use it with the battery. Everything else, I'm counting on you. Oh, wait. It is it. Um, thanks. And be careful. Stop it. I'm doing it for Robert and for myself. And I have a girlfriend named Kathy, too. I can't do <laughs> anything too drastic. All the characters are coming together. She'll kill me. Kathy? I see. So that was it. 
You guys are a great couple. I'm counting on you for her sake, too. Yeah, I know. I'm going to explain to Kathy now. What's wrong with his character model? I like this pose so, he yeah. took. This, like, yeah, so, standing okay. at attention. Yeah. Look at him, standing fully erect. What okay. a bunch of bollocks. Cool, everything's working now. Let's, <laughs> let's do an official save. Yeah. Now that this we know how to do Meg's, it. This is Meg's last escape. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that happens there, too. Totally forgot. Did you add that to the beginning of the videos, by the way? <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> good. It's good. It's a good addition. Should have done it way, way sooner, but... <laughs> That's fine. You know, inspiration only strikes it's when it can. Fun. Yeah. Not when I just want. I just noticed, I think this this nameplate under the window here actually does say Meg on it. Something Meg. But I can't tell exactly what. This We need yeah. AI upscaling for this. <laughs> actually, though, yeah. God. What a waste of time that would really be. A fax! What is that? It's a fax machine. <laughs> It's a fax. A fax? I wonder if it's from Jack. He sent you a fax to the Digiverse. Dear Meg, please read this, as I am reporting to you what I found about Sadako Yamamura. The incident that Sadako caused in Japan is all fact. She used her power to copy her curse to video, and you die one week after watching it. Apparently, Sadako had such powers from birth. She showed her powers when her mom, Shizuko Yamamura, was caught by the press as a public experiment. Yeah, I remember that a bit. Perhaps the will to curse humans came to Sadako by watching people mock her mother, but I'm not sure about the details. Sadako's power became a video, then a note, finally into a mutation of the smallpox virus in her body to plant the curse on humans. The mess had calmed down, but was revived by your chief bringing havoc to our country. I have a lot to say to the chief, but I will wait until everything is over for that. We need to lift Sadako's curse first, but I have no idea how to do that. <laughs> Apparently you need to help the curse propagate, but I can't think of a way how. However, your specialty is viruses, so I'm sure you can think of something. Considering that Sadako herself carries the virus, yet stays alive, I think you can create a vaccine from Sadako's body. I have no time to th so this is it, but I want you to seriously think about the vaccine. <laughs> Maybe Robert thought of the vaccine. I can think that, but I can't ask him anymore. It might be late now, but don't be reckless. I'll see you again. Jack. Dude, that read like it was from Metal Gear. I know, it was crazy. Ring? Lift Sadako's curse? Vaccine? I don't think he mentioned Ring, but anyway. Yeah, he did not. A public experiment using her mother trapped in a well for 30 years. She hates humans this much? It's impossible for someone like me to lift her curse. At least if I had the virus. A vaccine. Even if I can't lift the curse, if it's a virus, a vaccine. <laughs> Whoever localized this, like, I don't feel like You're, they did they great. They tried their best. They really did try their best, but like... But it was shit. Man, it's, it's a bad localization. <laughs> yeah, but if it was better, we wouldn't be having as much fun. Yeah, it figures that this is locked. That means I can't get out of here. Okay, I should use the phone then, I guess. I suppose so. Or the laptop. Uh, laptop. Uh, laptop. The laptop. The lappy, 486. I still have a little time before Lucino drops the power. I can get a quick, uh, a quick raid in. <laughs> At least, let me play this game. Yeah, this... Uh, Enter name, God. Meg. Thrill House. All right, it works. <laughs> <laughs> Let's finish this game before nightfall so I can figure everything out. You gotta get the game and you can play it. You gotta get the game and who can play it? <laughs> Meg will play it. It. I do find it odd that Meg's priority at this point is playing the game. Like, uh, she, has, she has time before Lucina drops the power. Yeah, get some quick frags in. 